Hey beautiful people, I hope you are keeping safe and well. Welcome to my YouTube channel. For those who I haven't met before, I'm Emma Ryder, Psychic Medium and Divine Channeler. And this is the Daily Twin Flame Read. So what do we need to know today? Please bear in mind I tend to read where the Divine Masculine is at and the message is coming through from the Divine Masculine. In no way, shape or form am I saying that the twin journey is one-sided. I know I have a lot of Divine Masculines watching. Please switch DM to DF if that resonates with your journey. Okay, so I'm going to use the animal cards today. And as I was getting ready to start recording, it fe really felt really important to say to you, pay attention to the signs you're getting. Trust in the signs you're getting. The angels, your loved ones in spirit, the universe, are helping you show you that you're on the right path okay and yes you might be getting signs which you're like is that really a sign for me if in doubt ask for confirmation of the signs you are receiving it's okay to be unsure and they want you to trust in them so ask for the confirmation you're needing you're not bugging them okay it just feels very important. It's like a day of alignment, um, which has just been discussed on the Daily Divine Guidance. But it is a day of alignment because the more you can keep pulling your energy back to looking after you and being in your best possible place, you are aligning with the energy of the Twin Flame journey. You have to be high energy, high vibed, very in the moment, and that helps everything flow easier. So whatever you're doing today, get in alignment. It's, it just feels so important. Okay, somebody needed to hear that. Let's have a look at the animal cars and where the Divine Masculine is at today. We've got the cheater card, okay, and the hummingbird card. And I actually feel very much like, I know we've just spoke about alignment, so, so many spirit around me tickling my ears, I can't, it's like, are you listening? So it feels very much like the cheater is signifying the speeding up of energies. The speeding up of energies and I want to say the speeding up of the divine masculine reaching out to you okay and i want to say this feels on the physical plane this doesn't feel on the telepathic plane this feels very much like a physical reaching out and it's speeding up the energies getting the energies into alignment so your divine masculine feels ready to reach out and We then have the cosmic egg card. I'm sorry, they're tickling my face so much serious today. Cosmic egg card. And for many of you, I think you'll probably be like, hmm. yeah, he's not going to reach out today. I don't believe it. It's never going to happen because it never does. I've been waiting for ages. Well, when you're in that energy of it's not going to happen, you're not actually in alignment, so pay attention to what you're manifesting with your thoughts. But also, the Cosmic Egg card really feels like this communication, this reaching out. I want to say reaching out more than communication because I feel for some of you it's a... They might just be turning up, but there's definitely a reaching out of some description, okay, on the physical plane. But the Cosmic Egg feels very much like it's going to happen when you're not expecting it. It's going to happen because you're least expecting it, but least expecting it, letting go of your, where you're wanting this to be and go, but knowing it will happen, not knowing it won't happen. So pay attention to how you are manifesting and aligning to this journey and where you're at, okay? Because least expecting it but knowing it will happen at some point is totally different than sat there 
thinking you're in alignment, saying, oh, it's never going to happen. Okay, so pay attention to those thoughts because it really is coming when you least expect it. Okay. <laughs> and then we've got the Stingray card. It really is like a shock, a shock to your system when this reaching out happens because it's, you're not expecting it yet. Okay. We then have the fish card, okay, which is really in that energy of going with the flow, allowing things to happen as and when they should. And that is really a part about being alignment too, okay? <laughs> Today is a day of alignment. Remember just to breathe and you can get in alignment. You can make those shifts, okay? And your divine masculine is coming into alignment, okay? That is why they've, they've got the speeding up of the energy around them. So you can help by getting yourself and really focusing on the alignment, okay? We then have the Hawk card, which is really that energy rising and becoming to, into alignment. Yeah, I'm going to say that a lot today, aren't I? I just knew it. Um, into alignment... Because when you're in alignment, your energy is high. You are vibrating at a high energy and you are in alignment with the energy of this journey. Think back to when good things happen in your life and how you were feeling when something flows right or when your twin came into your life. Everything might not have been great, but were you feeling good that day? Were you in alignment? What was your situation? Because you'll find that you go up and down in alignment, but when you're more conscious of it, you can do it with more consciousness and you can bring yourself back into alignment more easily and quickly, okay? And that really feels very important for both sides today, but it feels like the Divine Masculine really is in alignment to move these things forward. And we've got the Hawk card, and then we've got the Mouse and the Rabbit, and that really feels like the end of silence and the end of fear, because it's coming after the alignment and it really feels like we've moved beyond that. Um, because fear has been a big part of holding the divine masculine stuck. Fear of the unknown, fear of how life is going to be, fear of change. So it does feel like a letting go of fear and a standing tall in strength this energy of I am ready I am the lioness I am the lion I am ready I'm not scared do you ever see a scared lion they overcome that energy and they stand in their their strength we also have the bear card and that really feels like although they're strong they're not aggressive but it feels like it's almost like they're strong, but they're showing their soft side. So as this reaching out, they're feeling their soft side. They're feeling their feelings and reaching out and showing you the kind, loving side, which you know is within them, but you haven't always seen as clearly as... you would like you've known it's there but you haven't really seen it there's been this uh, barrier of protection around them not showing their true selves are you ready to get into alignment divine feminine you can help this they are in alignment and they feel like their energy is pacing up i want to say pacing up um and i've just like not many of you will know often pacing and we're often pacing which is like it is a horse race when they're pacing in their in their trotting, trotting races and it really feels like that excited energy as that man says off i'm pacing we're we're bringing that momentum of the faster energy things are picking up and building momentum okay so take care of yourself today know that your divine masculine is aligning and it's time for you to align
And if you haven't already, go and watch the Daily Divine Guidance because we talk about it a bit more there. Okay, let's have a look at the universe cards. What would love do? Feeling that love energy is fully in alignment. Okay. And things are about to get really juicy. Get ready, folks. Thank you so very much for joining me. Please do like and comment on the video if you feel drawn to. I really do appreciate it because the more likes and comments I get, the more YouTube show it to people. And I am very, very grateful for all of your help growing the channel. So thank you, thank you, thank you. If you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button. You will just get the notifications each day when the videos go live. So thank you. Please have a good weekend if I don't see you tomorrow, but I hope to see you tomorrow. Take care, stay safe. Namaste. Bye.